Since 2013, Nigeria has been fighting insurgency in form of the terrorist group Boko Haram. Since 2013, Boko Haram has killed thousands of people in northern Nigeria and kidnapped even more. The Nigerian government has had to accept all the help that it can get from both local and international bodies to aid the Nigerian armed forces in the fight. One of the people locally who has been fighting alongside the military against Boko Haram since inception is Aisha Gombi. Aisha Bakari Gombi, one of the few women who volunteered to fight the terrorist group, is 38 and 6 feet tall. She was born and raised near the Sambisa forest, the headquarters of Boko Haram. Formerly an antelope hunter, her experience and knowledge of the forest have made her the leader of a team of 15 to 20 male volunteers, despite her limited training in military operations. Every day, with her shotgun slung over her shoulder, she ventures into the scrums of Borno, the northeastern province of Nigeria, long plagued by Boko Haram attacks hunting down their fighters. She has been instrumental in the rescue of a high number of Boko Haram captives and she is front and center in the effort to neutralize the terrorist group. Her bravery and keen hunting abilities have earned her the title of Queen Hunter Government troops are quick to call on Aisha for her skills but slow to reward her efforts financially. Ms. Gombi is one of the recruits who helped the Nigerian army defeat Boko Haram and chase the terrorist group away from the forest. Unfortunately, right now she is unable to liberate many more captives held by Boko Haram due to a lack of resources, but she will never stop trying. Click the subscribe button for more and thanks for watching.